this is what I had growing back here on the compost cage. Um, and I had some of them, to me, they looked like hybrids. They didn't look like maybe they were crossed with something else. They just didn't look like they should. And I was uh, back here throwing some stuff in the compost cage and looked over and I found this. Looks like they're supposed to look, except it's maybe a little fat, I'm not sure. I have no experience with them, so I don't know what they're supposed to look like, but I just twisted it off the vine. And I think it'd be a good time to do a taste test while I got the camera out, so that's what I'm going to do. I can tell by the seeds that I let this go too long. Seeds really big. It's got a typical cucumber smell to it. I'm not going to eat the peeling, I'm going to just eat the flesh. It's got a slightly different flavor to it. I'm not sure exactly how to describe it. I'd call it I'd call it pretty mild. Let me take another little bite. I know it's, if you can imagine what the uh, rind of a watermelon tastes like when you start getting past the red, just a little bit into the white part, it kind of tastes like a cross between that and a regular cucumber. But I don't know if I'm going to get another one to taste before frost, but I hope I do, and I'll try to catch one before it gets so seedy but it's really not that bad sure got an interesting look to it I found another one after I got to looking around and this is one of the ones that I was talking about that I thought looked like they might be hybrids because this looks like a more of a normal cucumber skin here and and then this is how they're supposed to look down on this end. And Tanya's eagle eye found a couple more. So I'm not sure if anybody has experience with them more than I do. This is my first time growing them. Let me know if this is typical or not. And next year I might Maybe devote, would devote a better space for them, see how they do. We'll see.